All this month, get up to $50 off any Android smartphone from Appalachian Wireless. Any Android you desire. All $50 off with two-year agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Let's let them know that we're here today to stop this devastating disease and is Alzheimer's. Let's hear a big cheer. Saturday morning, the Pikeville City Park was filled with people wanting to help put an end to Alzheimer's disease. Statistics show every 60 seconds someone is diagnosed with the disease, and organizers say fundraising efforts for the 2017 Walk to End Alzheimer's in Pikeville not only met, but exceeded expectations. This is one of our biggest years in Pikeville so far. Well, we've got just over, I think, 200 participants. And then we came in yesterday, did our bank day, and we're already over our financial goal. So we're sitting at about $15,000 that we've raised so far. And, we and while fundraising is a big part of the event, the walk is also a time for those touched by Alzheimer's disease to connect with one another. You know, a lot of our people are caregivers. They don't have time to raise money. They don't have the ability. So we welcome any and all to come and feel the support of what we do. Everyone who registered for the event was given a flower to represent how Alzheimer's disease has touched his or her life. If someone supports or care gifts for an individual with Alzheimer's disease or another dementia, they have a yellow flower and they can personalize it with that person's name. If they've lost someone to Alzheimer's disease or another dementia, then they have a purple flower and they can put, you know, in memory of, you know, for me, Granny, on there and have that. And then we have a few little blue flowers that represent the folks with dementia that are able to join us. But there is one flower that so far has never been given to anyone diagnosed with Alzheimer's disease. Oh, the white flower symbolizes a cure, someone that beat Alzheimer's. So that's a promised flower that hopefully soon someone will get. In Pikeville, I'm Shannon Deskins for EKB News.